Camel is a venomous and herbivorous mammal that is known for its endurance and perfect adaptability to arid and desert areas where there are less water and food sources. The large animal often lives alongside humans in the warm deserts of North Africa and the Middle East, but despite its appearance, it has not always been domesticated. It seems that camels were first tamed by indigenous people about 5,000 years ago and have since played a prominent role in preserving human survival in arid and desert areas with very hot days and cold nights. In the following series of Animal Knowledge This Time, we have gone to camels and we intend to provide you with complete information about the appearance, behavior, and lifestyle of this animal. Camel Appearance the camel has a very special and unique appearance that helps it survive easily in arid and arid climates. The short, thick brown or cream-colored fur not only protects its skin from the sun, but also warms up in the cold night. The camel has long legs that help him to get a good distance from the hot surface of the earth, and two big fingers placed on each foot will spread the soles of the foot and prevent the camel from sinking into the sand. The layer covering the soles of the feet has also made the animal easily traverse rocky and rocky areas. The camel's large eyes give her good eyesight, has a strong sense of smell through her large nostrils, and two layers of long eyelashes help protect her eyes from the dust of the storms. Camels use the hump to store fat, and burning this fat during periods of water and food shortages can last for a long time. The camel has very few sweat glands compared to its large body, which causes its temperature to rise in heat, and since its body does not use water to cool itself, it loses water slower than other large mammals and its body becomes dehydrated later. The largest camel. A humpback camel is the largest type of camel. The length of the head and body of a camel is between 2.3 and 3.5 meters, and the length of its tail is 55 centimeters. The shoulder height of this camel is about 1.8 to 2.1 meters and weighs between 450 and 690 kilograms. Camel Behavior Characteristics Camels are animals that live in herds. Each herd of camels has a maximum of 40 camels, including females and their children, and one male that leads the herd. During mating season, the chief males protect the herd by biting, spitting, and pushing rival males. The camels lie down while resting, bending their front and back legs and sitting on them. The way a camel walks is different from many other mammals, moving first both of its left legs and then both of its right legs when walking. Types of camels. There are generally two types of camels. A camel or camel that makes up 94% of the world's population. Double humped camel. Llama camel, a type of camel without humps. Camel living place. Historically, camels live in deserts in North Africa and the Middle East to the West Indies, where there are soft, powdery dunes and harsh rocky areas. Today, there is no trace of wild camels in nature, and all camels are domesticated. Their ability to adapt to desert weather conditions has led them to be used to transport loads of over 200 kilograms over long distances and times. Millions of domesticated camels now live in these areas and fewer live in the deserts of Central Australia. Camel Food The camel is a vegetarian animal, but its diet is not entirely vegetarian and has been seen to chew bones and eat carcasses to supplement its nutrition. One of the most notable advantages of camels is having thick and gapped lips, which has made it easy for the animal to eat the hard and prickly plants that many animals avoid. The camel also likes very salty plants, which means that it is less competitive with other animals over food sources, and since it can store food in its hump as fat, it can use it for energy production if it does not find enough food and water. Camels can live without food until they lose up to 40% of their body weight and drink about 150 liters of water in a short period. Camel Enemy Although the camel has not lived in the wild for a long time, 
it can attract the attention of carnivorous predators due to its large size. Lions and leopards are the most important enemies of camels, but since they don't usually live in many arid areas of the carnivores, these animals are not constantly in danger of being hunted like vegetarians. Camel breeding. Female camels are ready for mating and reproduction from the age of three to four years and male camels from the age of five years old, and the male camel who heads the herd has the right to mate with females. The breeding season of the camels is between November and March and December to April. The gestation period of a camel is long and can last up to 13 months. In each delivery, a female camel usually gives birth to a baby camel and sometimes twins, which at the moment of birth often weighs up to 40 kilograms. The baby camel can stand on its feet within eight hours and uses breast milk to feed. She begins to eat grass at two or three months of age and weaned at approximately four months. Camel life. A camel usually lives 40 years. Interesting facts about camels. A camel without drinking water, if food is available, can survive up to 10 months. The animal can travel long distances every day, sometimes more than 30 kilometers, carrying loads of more than 200 kilograms. The camel can run long distances at 40 kilometers per hour, and if the owner is in a hurry, the speed of the animal reaches 67 kilometers per hour. Unlike other mammals, camels have unique oval red rosebushes, which help to better blood flow in the body in dehydrated conditions when the animal's blood becomes thicker. Although camels were first seen in the wilderness of Arabia, today there is almost no wild type at all. The camel's hump shrinks when the fat stored in it is used and becomes enlarged again when the animal consumes enough food and water. The camel's water bag is one of the internal organs that her body uses to store water. Camels are known to spit on people. This animal throws its stomach at others, and this is a defensive tactic for times when it feels threatened. The camel does not sweat until its body temperature reaches 41 degrees Celsius. Camel milk has more vitamin C and iron than cow's milk, which can be very beneficial for the body and is used in Kazakhstan to treat diseases such as tuberculosis. Camels can close their nostrils completely during sandstorms.